Gabby Diaz inside the Wild 94.9 VIP Lounge with Miss Taylor Gray. Hey, how are you? I am so good right now. Well, it's kind of cool because you're actually from the Bay Area. Yes, this is my home. <laughs> what part exactly? Right by Stanford University, actually. Oh, okay. Yeah. And you're going to school there. I am. Yeah, <laughs> didn't so, move. <laughs> so, what? I mean, you're you're pursuing your music career, but what like made you decide to just go to college too? On top of that, it's like a double career almost, right? It is. Yeah, I've always simultaneously loved music and education. Like right. I know I'm getting my degree. Um, I've always loved both growing up, and I think it's so important to stay in school for as long as possible. Yeah, totally. So, yeah, I value nice. both. And neuroscience? Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, dang. It's not as, it's not as <laughs> intense as you might, it sounds. Oh, okay. <laughs> How far along are you right now? I'm going into my junior year. Wow. So halfway. So almost, mm -hmm. almost. I like Thank it. You. <laughs> um, so how has life been since you dropped the album, Space Case? It's been so fun. It's been a whirlwind. I've loved it. I'm so happy to get this is like my first music that I've written since coming to college that right. has been released. Yeah. So I'm so excited that I feel like, the, you know, something that reflects who I am at this moment in life is finally out there and for right. people to hear. It's amazing. So how did it start, though? That's kind of I mean, I'm sure like you grew up listening to music or but what, how did it start? Like, why are you like, OK, I'm going to do this for real this time? <laughs> yeah. Oh, gosh, it's actually funny. I didn't grow up in a super music heavy wow, house. Really? Yeah, people are surprised by that. Wow. But my family didn't listen to music. My dad listened to uh, classic rock. So I grew up loving the Eagles, and I was always like really inspired by like the classics, the great artists. And right. I was like, wow, this is like art. This yeah. is important. Um, and I grew up, I was really shy as a kid also. Okay. So my mom just threw me into musical theater. She's like, nope, you're going to be on stage. And so since I was six, I was on stage and got over my shyness. And, here and then what was like the big break for you to like actually start going to radio, doing promo and all of that? Like, well, how did that happen? I feel so lucky. I feel like I've had a bunch of little breaks along my journey of people who I've gotten to work with. I think what's been amazing is the end of uh, last summer getting to work with Josh Abraham and Nico Stadi, nice. who um, produced Justin Bieber, among many others. So getting to work with the greatest producers, um, one of the greatest, was kind of surreal. And I was like, yeah. whoa, me? I was like, <laughs> you, you're talking to me? Like, you're talking to me, right? <laughs> yeah, and For just my, my team is so amazing. Um, and yeah, the album definitely helped. So the summer has been such a crazy ride. And you were on tour with Jacob Whiteside. Yes. He is amazing. I love him. He's, He's the best. So fun. <laughs> any fun memories from tour? Oh, gosh, yes. Um, any so pranks? many. I want to know if there were any pranks. There weren't a ton of pranks. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I heard the last show, uh, he carried me out on stage. Oh, my god. Which gosh. was so cute. It was so nice. He was like, I'm going to carry you out. It'll be, it'll be cute. But the stage, the walkway was so small so oh I was my like gosh. my feet were hitting my head was like hitting everything on the way there <laughs> and he sent me down like two seconds before my cue to start singing was so I was like in a panic to grab my mic oh and like was fumbling gosh. all over myself and you had heels on I take it oh yeah I think I had these shoes on so <laughs> you know they're not they're not exactly marathon uh, material yeah no <laughs> I don't know how like I wear heels if I have to, but I've just fell so many times. Like, it's all True, bad. Yeah, it's I can admit it. <laughs> it's horrible. <laughs> well, listen, um, it was so dope to see you perform. Thank I you. mean, the album is great. I actually took a listen to it this morning, and I was like, okay, girl, I see you. I like this. Thank you. So we're anxious to just kind of see what else is coming. And, you know, when uh, you're here in the Bay, come visit. We always would love to say hi. Okay? I always love the Bay. Anytime yeah. you have me, I am here. Always. Perfect. Well, thank you. Thank you so much, Taylor Gray, for stopping by. It's Gabby Diaz in the Wild 94.9 VIP Lounge. Give it up for Taylor. Thank you, <laughs> Thank you so much.